Well, if you've been waiting to know just how close we came to seeing Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, we now have the answer coming at us directly from the writer of the film. And if he's to be trusted, not very close at all. So this news comes at us directly from Michael Waldron, who was recently talking about everything going on in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, and of course all the cameos that were considered. One of the ones that was brought up on multiple interviews was of course Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool, because that was something that was pretty much um, in everybody's mind a foregone conclusion that we were going to get it, just because of all the circumstances leading to it multiple leaks that legit looked real like we are talking about scenes directly in the film that had other art and leaks that looked legit that showed deadpool so everybody pretty much kind of assumed yeah he's gonna be in it waldron decided to tackle this head-on and saying well they talked about it they talked about ryan reynolds appearing as deadpool but that's as far as it got they never got past the hey could we include deadpool we could okay and then they moved on and figured out who else would be showing up. So they never made an offer. They never went after Ryan Reynolds or trying to get Deadpool in there or anything like that. Now, some people don't believe this and I understand why, but it's one of these things where you never know what was happening. Remember when we had that concept art of Deadpool in Shang-Chi and it turns out it's real concept art, but it was never something that Marvel Studios officially asked for. The artist just did it. Maybe the CG pre-visuals that we saw were just the team having fun with it because, again, they're a production house that's worked with Marvel Studios and Fox for the better part of the last decade. So maybe they just for fun dropped them in there as a sort of what-if scenario, which that can legitimately happen. And then it leaked because of somebody. So who really knows what the truth here is? My guess is the truth is somewhere in the middle of what everybody said. Whatever the case may be though, I don't think Deadpool would have fit into the film at all the way the film came out. Maybe if it was the 40 minute longer Raimi cut, maybe. But again, what would you really get from it? Right? Like, a comedic cutaway? No thanks, I don't think that would have worked. But, hey, um, you know, Deadpool's coming soon, so you're not gonna have to wait too long to see him in the actual MCU.